Here's a tip of the week. Um, we are filled with dualities. When those dualities show up in our conversations, others get confused, lose trust, and get angry. As human beings, we are constantly experiencing dualities in ideas or behaviors. We can be conscious of some of these dualities, such as knowing what to eat, how to exercise, how to manage time, state that we're really committed to doing it, eh, and not take any action. There are times that we say our belief about a matter and not be conscious that we do the opposite, such as stating, mm, I'm honest and don't like people to lie, but lie constantly and have justifications for it. When our dualities only affect us, we tend not to have results that we want. When our dualities affect others, we lose the quality of the relationship. People can't count on us, they lose respect and trust, and they hold back and doubt who we are and our intentions. Teenagers start calling their parents a hypocrite at this time. These types of expressions of dualities create many marital arguments since a married couple makes many decisions together in all areas of life. Clarity and consistency become very important. Sometimes there's no duality. It is just a lack of clear communication. One part of the thought process has been shared while another part has not been expressed which is still leaves the listener confused when they see an action that is not based on what they heard or expected first. So clarity in communication is important. However, the most important factor that would be a prerequisite for that communication is internal clarity. It is the awareness of our different parts, needs, desires, and vulnerabilities that are so important. The process of negotiation between the parts facilitates the integration, therefore creating a sense of integrity and wholeness between our thoughts, emotions, and actions. When we become conscious of our impact on our surroundings and watch for others' reactions to our actions and seek feedback from others about us, we become in tune about our dualities and can begin to integrate our different or opposing beliefs. Our conversations and actions will then be based on a unified inner self and alignment between our thoughts, our words, our actions, and brings integrity and congruency within ourself in relationship to ours. We can feel confident, others can count on us, believe in us, and know that when we say something, we're gonna do it. And the whole, the most important factor is when you say you're gonna do something, you're gonna feel confident that you're gonna keep your word. And that's when you're gonna feel the most powerful. For the awareness integration skills, go to my book, Life Reset, the awareness integration path to the life you want, and you can find that in fujan.com or Amazon. Togetherness Media. Togethernessmedia.com.